cold day across northeast Wisconsin. Highs today barely made it into the single digits. We'll see a very similar day for tomorrow. High of three and then 11 degrees by Tuesday. Then we slowly but surely start to warm up Wednesday, Thursday into Friday with temperatures almost near normal by the end of the week and into next weekend. Right now it's one degree here in Green Bay as well as out in Clintonville, two below in Appleton and one in Manitowoc. So we're already starting to see areas dip below zero. Wind chills right now ranging anywhere between 20 below to 25 below. So very cold as of right now across northeast Wisconsin and highs today only made it into the lower single digits. We hit a high of three degrees here in Green Bay as well as out in Clintonville. High of 7 out towards Shawano. 10 degrees down in Oshkosh. Another cold day ahead of us tomorrow with gusty wind conditions. Right now wind speeds coming directly out of the west anywhere between 10 to 20 miles an hour. Wind gusts up to around 25 to 30 miles per hour. So that's why we feel so cold outside. It's funneling in colder air from the north. And we are under a wind chill advisory throughout the entire state of Wisconsin as well as Minnesota down towards Illinois and Iowa. So it's a Midwest chill that's moving across the area. Checking in at negative three right now in Minneapolis. Nine degrees down towards Chicago, six in Des Moines. So it's widespread across the Midwest. It's cold moving into the area. 22 below zero. Wind chills out towards Minneapolis. Feels like it's 23 below out towards International Falls and 12 below in Bismarck. Right now we have a high pressure system that's pushing through bringing in the much cooler air and we'll see this high pressure system in place over the next 48 hours giving us relatively calm conditions across Wisconsin. You see here not too much going on. We could see a little bit of lake effect snow out towards the northern half of Door County but overall staying dry here across northeast Wisconsin. The big uh, weather news for us is going to continue to be the cold temperatures as we start off your work week. For tonight though temperatures drop into uh, the below zero area. 10 below is what we're forecasting here in Green Bay. We'll see t temperatures tomorrow struggle to make it into the positive area, high of around 3 in Green Bay. And then we drop back down into below zero as we go into the overnight hours. Wind chills very similar to what we saw today for tonight. We'll see anywhere between 20 to 30 below zero. And then for tomorrow, very similar with wind chills anywhere between 25 to 30 below zero. So very cold night ahead of us with very cold start to the work week. Tonight, we drop to 10 below with partly cloudy skies. Wind chills anywhere between 10 to 20 degrees below zero with a west wind between 10 to 15 miles per hour. So breezy conditions that'll stick around for tomorrow with a high of three, partly sunny skies, frigid and breezy with a west wind between 10 to 15 miles per hour. Cold for Tuesday, high of 11 with overnight lows dropping to five below. 21 by Wednesday with an overnight low of five, partly to mostly cloudy skies. That'll continue on into Thursday with a high of 23. And then we make it to near normal by Friday, high of 25 with a mixture of some sun and clouds. Breezy conditions on Saturday with mostly cloudy skies, high of 27 and then finally reaching the 30s by next Sunday. So very cold stretch of weather for us for today and for tomorrow, Raquel, but we do see a light at the end of the tunnel by the end of the weekend and uh, into next week. So just bundle up if you're headed outside. Good thing I got my hats and gloves. Yeah, good thing. Still ahead on NBC 26, live at 5, a new attraction in Howard is bringing out dozens